Hopefully you guys can hear me over the washer and dryer instead of doing a voiceover because you guys know my laptop that I have now that I'm trying to edit on is lagging and stuff just doesn't add up. But I am getting ready to fold this laundry. I have something in the washer and I also have something in the dryer. So hopefully you guys can hear me over it and hopefully I'm not too loud. But does anyone else have like never ending laundry? I literally have to do laundry every day or else I would, it, it turns into this. It turns into this. I literally have to do a load every day, you guys. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. I actually need to cut up this towel because once my towels start to look like this, like we use a towel once and then we wash it. I don't believe in using the same towel or washcloth more than once in one day. So we use it once and you put it in dirty clothes. I just, but like I was saying, I like to use one towel per every time I wash up. One towel and two washcloths. I know I sound crazy. This is another reason why I have a lot of laundry every day, but it is a must like, I don't know. I just, I can't. But like I said, once they start to fray like this, I typically turn them into like rags that I use to clean around the house. But I don't feel like going to get the scissors. So whatever, we're just going to leave that there. This is what I'm talking about when I turn them into rags. You see, this is, was a towel and now it's all raggedy. I don't fold them. show you what I'm doing so it's like that I fold it in half and then I fold it again so when I was younger my mom used to, maybe that's why I am the, the way I am now but everything had to be perfect well as perfect as possible like towels I mean sorry not towels but tags couldn't be sticking out of the towels or washcloths or anything like that y'all so I'll show you guys how I fold my washcloths First, I, f I mean not washcloths, these are dishcloths. First, I find the tag, and it has to be on my right, I know. <laughs> and then I just fold up, turn it, and then just roll it. And that's how the dishcloths go. I do use bleach on all of our white towels and washcloths, or whatever is white. Whenever my family brings their clothes down, it's when I wash. So if I see like their clothes sitting downstairs, which is unfortunate that our washer and dryer is in our kitchen, but if I, whenever I see the clothes sitting in the kitchen, I'll uh, wash them for them. And that is everything for that is all for that. I wish it was everything. That is everything for the linen. I do believe the rest are clothes. And I'll show you guys how I fold my clothes. Let me just put these in this basket so they're all ready to be taken upstairs and put away. I accidentally just dropped them. But being that I'm already in the kitchen, I'm gonna go ahead and put everything that belongs in the kitchen away. Here we have that. I'm gonna put these two things away. So I'll show you guys how I fold my shirt. This is a crop top, so. Show you guys, fix the sleeves. I fold it in half. So it's folded in half. Matter of fact, let's get these to match up. Let's get the corners to match up perfectly. Now, I only fold, it's so funny, I only fold my clothes like this. Simply because I am the only person in the house that cares what their drawer looks like. My family doesn't care, so I just fold theirs like, it still be neat, but it don't be like this. And 
then I take that in, fold it up a little bit, fold it a little bit, and there we have it. So they can go in a drawer just like this. I know, I'm crazy. And also I can see like what is actually on the shirt. It's a little crooked. There we go, much better. But yeah, that's all I do. And I'll show you, I just bought all, the, all of this stuff. Old Navy was having like a little sale, a sale and I had some rewards that I had to get rid of. So I'll show you guys how I do these. sure hope my washer and dryer is not like super loud and you guys can hear me so let's fold these in half see these are new I've never folded these so I'm trying to figure out how I want to fold them hopefully this turns out let's, let's do this there we go do that I don't know if I fold it this now let's fold this one up. I'm gonna have to figure out how I wanna fold those, but you know. And this is just a jacket that I'm hang up. If I have to hang something up, I'm not gonna fold it. Like, that makes absolutely no sense to me. Show you guys how I fold my jeans. I wish I could get like the whole table, but hopefully you guys, you can see, oh, you can see a good deal of it. Take this in, fold this up, take all of that in, fold it down just a little bit, and then bring the rest up. So that it looks like this. And I have a drawer that this goes into, and it goes in just like that. I'll show you guys how I would typically fold like my family's clothes, because like I said, they don't care if their drawers are chaotic. So I would typically just take theirs and do it like this. And maybe like that <laughs> and that is so ugly I couldn't I wouldn't be able to function if anything in my drawer looked like that so let's go ahead and do it the way I like it which is bringing this bring it up down and we are good just like that Now I will show you guys how I like to fold my underwear. These are new, so they don't really care if you guys see them. <laughs> so I have my underwear just like this. I will show you. I fold it down basically halfway. Fold it halfway, flip it over, bring one side in, bring the other side in, and then I just roll them up. Oh. I'm trying not to like get my head in the shot. And then, I feel like I messed up. Let me do this without like, not trying to get my head in the shot. <laughs> And then that's how my underwear goes into my drawer. And I have like these little containers that my underwear go into. I really don't have a special way on how I fold my bras. But I will just go ahead and fasten them. And then I'll just do like the normal way that we grew up knowing. So I'll just do that and tuck everything in and then they'll go into my drawer. I wanted this one thing like the bras set like, like this on them. But it was super expensive. Let me know in the comments down below how you guys fold your bras.
realize I didn't show you guys how I fold my socks. So typically with my socks, I do that, that, and all I do is roll them. I like for my socks to sit in my drawer, just like, oh, no baby, what you doing? But once they're in the drawer, they sit like this nice and pretty. So I just put this over here so it doesn't unroll and put something on top of it. But yeah, that's all I do with my socks, you guys. But if you guys have any suggestions or if you want to see how I fold something else, let me know in the comments down below. I need to, next time I uh, do laundry, I'm going to like scissors with me so I can get like rid of these little threads that are hanging off of the clothing and whatnot. All right, so here is everything that I folded tonight. I had my son take up their clothes already. This big old pile right here is everything that needs to be hung up into our closet. My, these are mostly pajamas. And this, some of this stuff is new. Shirts, uh, biker shorts, jeans, pajamas, pajamas, regular pants, 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 underwear, a scarf and my socks but if you guys enjoyed this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button and i'll talk to you all in my next video bye